hello friends welcome to my channel this is Charan in this video I will show you how to create a contact us page to send emails using PHP coding in WordPress it's a four step process and the step one will create a bootstrap HTML5 contact us page I'm using notepad plus plus to write the code just for the time saving the designing part I'm pasting here it's a simple designing which contains a bootstrap links as well as name email message which is body and one submit button let's save this file I'm giving this name as wordpress email dot php save and this file saved on my desktop log. before continuing the coding part I will upload this php file into my remote server after I log into my GoDaddy account, right now I'm in the file manager. I'm uploading the files in the root directory, web root. Upload. Click add file. And the file I saved at the desktop, which is a WordPress email. This one. File has been uploaded successfully. Let's copy this file name and we'll check on the browser. And the domain name is a great discounts.codadin. In the browser, I'm typing great discounts.codadin. The file name is WordPress hyphen email.php. Press enter. And this is the designing part how it looks. But notice here in the URL it's showing the PHP file. I have not added this PHP file into my WordPress blog process which I will show you after writing the coding part. Let's flip back to my coding part and the PHP code I'm writing the about doc type I'm declaring a variable name is equals to dollar underscore post here the name is the input control name copy that and paste here dollar from is equals to dollar underscore underscore post and from address is the email dollar message is equals to dollar underscore post which is a message it's a body body paste here dollar subject is equals to Receive mail from from this person name. Dollar two is equals to, and the two is my email ID. Contact at great discounts dot co dot in. Now we'll write the headers. Headers is equals to MIME hyphen version 1.0 dot backward slash R and backward slash N. dollar headers notice here I'm giving dot is equals to content hyphen type colon text slash HTML cat set is equals to UT UTF 
hyphen h dot backward slash or and black backward slash n and the last headers so here headers headers is equals to from between the tags this variable copy here and paste backward slash r and backward slash n now the next step is we need to write a function called is set to the submit button but that part I am writing after this submit button control because I want to display the message below the submit button so after the new tag of submit php if is set function dollar underscore post and here's a parameter we use a button submit control the name test here if now mail method which takes four parameters is two dollar subject dollar message dollar headers echo thanks for email will get back as soon as possible else the mail is unable to send fail to send your mail that's it the coding part I'm saving this file again now I will upload this file again into my remote server after I adding the PHP code again I have to upload the file click upload add file this is a file open the second step also done and now the third step is we have to call this PHP file into my WordPress blog post it's time to log into my WordPress dashboard. I just logged into my WordPress dashboard. Let's create a blog post. Add new. If you want, you can create pages also, but I'm creating add new post. And the title I'm giving contact us object. Close the object here. the first property I'm using the data height and the width here the height I'm using 500 and the width I'm using 1000 in the data now in the proper now in the data property I'm giving the PHP file name and this data is a small is around 600 I'll make it now I'm click publish now copy this permalink go to appearance 
click menus in the menu one I don't have any contact us page let's create the contact us link paste that URL which we created and the text link is contact us add to menu here the custom link contact us added to the menu save menu after saving the menu it's a testing time let's open my website on the browser now in the browser I'm typing my website name greatdiscounts.co.in contact us page click see now the PHP file was added to the blog post contact us and the name I'm giving Sam Sam at gmail.com this is Sam sending test mail from WordPress using PHP code send mail and here is a message thanks for email we'll get back as soon as possible let's log into my godaddy email account we'll check the mail has been received or not i just logged into my godaddy workspace email we'll check the inbox and here is the email and this is the email we just sent sam at gmail received from sam this is Sam sending test mail from WordPress using PHP code. Thanks for your time to watching this tutorial. If you like this video, please leave your valuable comment, share this video and please subscribe my channel. Catch you on my upcoming videos.